hey guys glad to have you back welcome back to my channel so today i want to be talking about me journey and uh, i want to see some of the pieces that have been created through uh, this ai product uh, for those who are not aware of me journey uh, it's basically an independent research lab that uh, has recently made a lot of news uh, regarding its output in uh, creating art and designs and for those creators out there who are into making art and designs uh, for some of those who make websites uh, basically any kind of art or mockups this is really going to be helpful for you in your work basically making your work much easier much faster and uh, I'm actually interested in how far AI has developed in regards to art and design. Now, what this particular AI does, it basically takes inputs through uh, text prompts and parameters and uses machine learning algorithm trained on a large amount of image data to produce unique images. Now, I want us to go through, or I want us to look at some of the pieces or some of the images or the designs that have been created by this AI. Of course, uh, following uh, the inputs that have been put by uh, humans. Let's have a look at some of those and then we shall get back to the topic, answering a few questions you may have about the journey. So I think you've seen some of uh, the products or the output or the apps that this AI can create in just a short period of time, basically in just minutes or seconds. Now I'll be answering some of the questions you maybe have, for example, uh, one asks me whether they have to pay to use Majani. Yes, right now you have to pay, but before when you had just come out it was totally free of charge but right now you need to pay uh, a paid subscription could range between 10 to 50 dollars depending on what you want i hope i answered your question right so uh, someone else asked me whether they can make uh they can use midjourney for commercial use yes the answer is yes if you have paid if you have a paid subscription Obviously, you can use uh, your account to create images or products that you can commercially use. I know some of you could have uh, questions whether mid general products are ethical. Well, it depends on how you define ethical or the level of ethical you are okay with. Uh, basically, what AI does is it picks a bunch of sources from different places and uh, generates parameters on which to perform 
uh, your task or your depending on the inputs you have provided then it will definitely provide an art for you just like you asked it this also depends on its capabilities now if we to focus on the ethical bit of it well i'll leave that for you to judge at a personal level or someone in the comment section could uh, tell us more what they think of ai do they think ai is ethical or not uh, personally i'm impressed with uh, the level of output and with uh, the level of development ai has got into i think this is gonna make work much faster for those who invest in it and for those who use it it will make uh, our work much easier i'll also actually be using ai generated products to make my work much faster uh, if you enjoyed the video give me a thumbs up leave your comments down below with your thoughts what do you think of this ai and what it does uh, you could leave a comment suggesting what other kind of videos you want me to make on this channel but i think this was uh, an interesting topic to share with you and also look into otherwise i'll leave you with these pieces as uh, you continue with the video i'll see you in my next video thank you goodbye